Hey everyone, it's Dean and welcome to the first football vlog of the year and it comes in the last home and away round of the season. I wanted to start it off uh, sort of by apologising and going, I'm sorry for not um, doing more of them this year. It sort of got away from me a little bit. I've been to pretty much every game in Melbourne. I missed a few, so probably about 13 or so. I actually went to my first interstate game as well this year for like a home and away game. I went to Richmond and the Giants at Giants Stadium and I sort of wanted to use this video as a bit of a, you know, a bit of an overall season package, I guess, highlights package of all of the, of, of some of the clips from the year. Um, also this year with our membership, we've been able to go back to Punt Road after the games and actually a couple of players would come in and talk to us about the game. So you're going to see some snippets of Cochin at the end of this one. Um, but, you know, we saw players like Tom Lynch, uh, Sydney Stack, Jack Rewald, you know, Dusty, Prestia, Hooley. Like, there's so many players that we ended up seeing back at the room, which was really, really cool. And, yeah, it's, it's just been, like, a very exciting year for me at the football. Um, and, of course, in a couple of weeks, it is the finals. We'll get to that in the actual video as to what's going on there. But um, Richmond taking on the Lions. It's exciting. But, yeah, I kind of didn't really do a lot of videos. Like, I filmed bits and pieces here and there, but never really filmed enough to put together a full video. So for that, I am sorry. But hopefully I will have some good videos of the final series coming up. Kinda didn't really know a structure of how to put the videos together. So that's something I'm kinda working on and wanna do a little bit better. But uh, let's just get into the video and you can kind of see and let me know what you think about this new style. What is going on everybody? My name is Dean, or as most of you know me, Twisty3. Now today I'm going to the football, it is Richmond versus Brisbane. Now, I'd like to think I'm not getting ahead of myself here, but on the off chance with Richmond win, I've already looked up the flights here to get me from Melbourne to Brisbane, just on the off chance that we will be playing the Brisbane Lions. And it's $422 now. What are the odds that they are going to go up by at least $100 each way by the time I get home if Richmond do end up winning this game? So, massive stakes today. Top four on the line. Big, big game happening right now. But um, I'm going to go ahead to the footy. We'll, we will see how it goes. Oh, the crowd. 
crowd are upset now. Shocking decisions. But it's the Tigers at the half by 26. So other than my finger featuring as the main attraction in this video, I wanted to just pop in and go, sorry for, you know, not really having too much like halftime analysis. Um, because the third term, Brisbane started really well. But you'll hear me ramp up a little bit more as the second half uh, goes on. Goose. Look at the shot clock next time, please. Taking as much time off the clock as he can. That's what he's doing. That's why he's just waiting. See? That's how you watch the shot clock properly. Oh. 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 Disappointed. The game is finished, it was time to head back to the Tigers rooms and listen to Trent Koshin and Noah Volta have a few words. Next next vlog, I will promise I will feature more heavily. I'm slow at getting back at this. Game yeah, that's worth four points, but when it's in the back part of the year and you know a top four spots riding on it, it's hard not to be distracted at different times. But um, you know, I think a lot of the the mental work that we do during the week and during the season holds us in really good stead to focus on the things that we can control rather than what we can't. And uh, what the opposition bring, injuries, whatever it is outside of what we can control, obviously means not much. So we'll focus on what we can. And we felt we did that to a pretty good level today. Uh, I think the exciting thing for us is that we feel as though we've still got a lot of growth in us, which is uh, exciting going in the finals. Yeah, we. You know, it doesn't matter what ground we're on, we back our structure and the way we play to, you know, hopefully get the win up there as well. So that's it. We're in the top four. I have booked flights to Brisbane. Hopefully I get tickets when they go on sale on Thursday. Uh, but let's end this video with a bit of crowd action after the game. Oh!